Hey guys, what's up? This is Sean Heather and in this video we are going to have a detailed camera review of Huawei Mate 10 and Mate 10 Pro. It comes with Leica dual camera setup, 1x1.6 aperture lens, so one 12 megapixel camera for RGB imaging and one 20 megapixel camera for monochrome photography. So we are going to see that how good all of these specs of Huawei Mate 10, Mate 10 Pro camera is going to perform in real life scenario and we will check all of the features in the camera and their performance as well. So let's just start it. So first of all let's have a look on the camera UI. This is the camera user interface as you can see on the top there are lots of options. If you tap on this you will be able to select the color saturation whether you would like to go with a standard vivid or smooth color and here is the living image that's called moving picture on Huawei Mate 10 Mate 10 Pro what it does exactly that it captures a small video right before an image to show what was happening at that moment and then there is the portrait mode that let you create a nice bokeh effect in the background and beautify the person in the image and then there is the wide aperture mode you can tap on this and then you can select the aperture level to create nice depth of field here are some samples of the pictures captured on the wide aperture mode on Huawei Mate 10 Pro or Mate 10 smartphone And then there is flash option if you swipe from left to right you will find lots of options like photo monochrome video SDR, 3d panorama panorama night shot light painting time lapse slow motion filter watermark document scan and cut photo if you tap on more you will get a few more options available for you and since I have already downloaded everything so you can see that all of them are installed if you got a brand new Huawei Mate 10 Mate 10 Pro so you can install few of them from here 3d panorama that you capture 3d panoramic image of an object here are some samples of the 3d panorama and this is how exactly it works the panorama mode works really great provide lots of detail and the stitching is really impressive using the night shot you get the option for the ISO and shutter speed so you can select the ISO as high as 1600 and if you talk about the shutter speed it goes as high as 32 seconds but you will have to use a tripod to capture a good image using the night shot mode here are a few samples of the low light photography all of them are used on auto mode not on the night shot mode but still the performance of Huawei Mate 10 Pro or Mate 10 camera is really nice and then there is light painting that, that let you capture nice pro level images for tail lights light gravity silky smooth water and star track for all of these you will have to use a tripod once again and then there is time lapse and slow motion video recording you can also add some filters right on the user interface and these are the live filters as you can see here you can even select the level of filter you want on your picture if you tap on this and select any other filter and then you can use this slider to increase or reduce the filter effect and then there is the watermark feature it's very interesting because it let you include lots of stuff on your image as you can see that you can select the categories like time location weather your mood food and there's sport activity as well so this is really a nice and fun feature on the Huawei Mate 10 camera if you select any of these for example this so you can see there will be a live demo of watermark and you can even drag and drop it anywhere on the screen and then there is document scan feature this is really useful feature that let you scan an image and capture it 
perfectly making it rectangular without any issue. And the last one is the good food mode as the name suggests. It is designed especially to capture the images of food increasing color saturation and contrast to make it look more beautiful. Here are some examples of micro shots captured on Huawei Mate 10 and Mate 10 Pro smartphones. As you can see, the performance is really good and lots of detail comes in the images. And here are a few samples from the front facing camera with and without the portrait mode and the beautification. And now some samples of monochrome imaging as you can see the performance is really good lots of detail great amount of sharpness and everything is really good when it comes to monochrome imaging on Huawei Mate 10. The HDR mode works quite good as well as you can see in this sample here. The first image is without HDR and the second one is with HDR effect. And then if you swipe from right to left then you will find lots of options here like you can customize whatever you want whether you would like to add watermarks of Leica camera whether you would like to get the GPS tags in your images then you can mute the shutter button lots of options like capture smiles just to capture object tracking in the image you can even customize the volume button function whether you would like to use it to capture image or for zoom or to focus so lots of options are provided here in the settings and then on the main user interface you will find this button for zoom option if you just tap on it it will go to 2x zoom and if you want to go higher you can just zoom in like this it goes as high as 10x digital zoom but there is 2x lossless zoom provided here as you can see in this slider but the zoom is only available for 12 megapixel or less resolution images if you go to 20 megapixel the zoom functionality is not available so you need to keep this thing in mind while using Huawei Mate 10 or Mate 10 Pro smartphone and then there is the pro mode that is available for both images and videos you just need to swipe up from here and you will get all of these options for ISO shutter speed brightness autofocus and white balance so you can customize it the way you want this is a very useful user interface very easy to use and it comes with lots of options as you can see here so the pro mode on Huawei Mate 10 and Mate 10 Pro camera is really nice as you can see even for the shutter speed lots of speeds are provided from very low to very high if you're a pro photographer you will love the pro mode of Huawei Mate 10 and Mate 10 Pro camera so that's all for now friends thanks for watching the video and do not forget to subscribe the channel for more videos tips and tricks and hands on videos like this i'll see you guys next time in another video have a nice day